In this lesson, I want to explain that something called if you right click subdivide, you can subdivide the object. It means in this case, you can add <coughs> more polygon to existing polygon. For example, this pl uh, platonic here, it's different between subdivision surface. This is a real subdivision, real smooth object. If you right click, you can access the tool here or it's a mesh add subdivided this subdivided is uh, connected with the uh, weight subdivision surface that i explained it before when when i explained uh, this tool subdivision surface here. you can refer it that is real subdivision but here you can add polygon for example if you have if you need more polygon for example this edge and of course you need these hard edges you can right click and subdivide it before that click on this gear to open its settings we have a uh, something like pattern it means uh, loop or opposite uh, mode this is a mathematical or engine to how this uh, tool act if I tick that, as you can see, you can a smooth subdivision. You can add some bands, but I don't like it. I want to add <coughs> the subdivision. If you deactivate the so smooth or untick that, it's add just polygon. As you can see, two settings will be turned off. And this is in subdivisions. It's if this one means, for example, if you OK, as you can see, the one add uh, for polygon, for example, it's better you better understand as you can see it's it's keep the hard edges but add a polygon in a in a this cube here if you right click and uh add a click to see this the one here it means it's cut this edge to four it's one power four it's mathematical as you can see or of course you can just uh, subdivide one polygon if you want if you like the settings, you don't need to be this click that yet. Just select subdivide. And as you can see, it's make it four. But if you set it to two, it's double that div divisions. Okay. And keep that hard edges as you can see like this. But in this case, for example, <coughs> if you right click and subdivision, you can add no in this case you can also smooth it for example here you can activate the smooth the subdivision will turn off and with this iteration the angle you can smooth the object like this let's act like subdivision surface but it's a different behavior okay it's add the polygon and of course the smooth the hard edge you can tick or untick that option that you want, but actually we don't need to. In the, I use uh, often subdivision, subdivided tool for uh, adding polygon to uh, my object. If you if your object is parametric, you can simply click and drag and, and segment. But if you make it editable, editable everything's end. And you have to use subdivided tool for adding polygon to your object. See these images. As you can see, this is different mode of the uh, subdivision. As you can see, it's if we have an end gun here. This is uh, Cadman Clark. This is loop, and this is opposite. As you can see, we, this tool have different behavior in different situations. For example, cutting here. As you can see, the topology and the algorithm is very different. And here, for example, we have this object and we have this object. We add a subdivided, not a smooth. As you can see, the topology in Calvin Clark is very clean and nice. Default is this. Some cases you need this or loop. Okay. You can see which topology do you want. Okay, this is subdivided tool. Hello, my friends. To continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.